Prabha Nagarajan, a long time resident of Chennai. And this is my husband of 42 years. 42? I should think so. Yeah, 42 years. Nagarajan Mahadevan. Sustaining. Come, take one of me and Nikki here. See here. Huh? Nick's come. The surgery. Mm. That place, no, where the hospital with 15 beds. Under the charge of a physician. Besides the physician, they had one surgeon, two persons for fetching and preparing herbs, two nurses, and a barber for performing minor operations. <laughs> now we are in our, at our home in Kodikinal. It's in a small town called Attamampatti. It's about seven kilo, which is about seven kilometers from the heart of Kodikinal near the lake. And we've had this home for a fairly long time. And uh, we normally come any time from two days to 20 days. And we had a bonus last year when the COVID came. We got to stay here for nine months. Tell about the journey of the house. How we got this house and how we did it. You were instructing me. She says, she asked the question. <laughs> In uh, 1996, we located this property, uh, which was developed by a friend of ours. And uh, he was building and handing it over to the residents or the buyers. And we opted to have our own design. So from this point, at the end of the property, we could have a good view of the house earlier. But now it's all the fauna is kind of grown and we can barely see the house. Flora, Manima. Ah, the flora, sorry, not the fauna. I said to him that walk along the gradient, maximize the views, and bring the outdoors as much as possible indoors, which is what we did. We also decided to have six bedrooms because we have a large family and we thought of the future as well when, and hoped for many family holidays, which sadly are not happening right now because the children have all grown up and gone away. Yeah, you're wearing a striped pyjama and I'm wearing a striped pyjama. The party men had gone, Alibaba climbed down the tree, walked to the rock and said, Open sesame. Open sesame. He said all kinds of things. Open the ram. Open the dame. Jayanti. Hi, Jayanti. No problem. Uh, we are home, we are bringing food now, so in 5 minutes we will leave here. So we should be there technically 12.30. Okay? Alright, thank you. I I want to say that people are, I find people a lot more warm here than they are in a big city. I enjoy food, I enjoy food and cooking, and whether it's just for me or for family or friends. And sharing is, is very big in Korean. Hi, We cook a large portion and we always send it to friends or friends cook all food and send it to us. So, though the ho homes are quite far away from each other, there's still a big sense of community. Especially here in the valley, we've got some excellent friends. Free butter pies. Okay, nice. The credit goes to Raja here now. Special thanks to him. Okay, okay. Okay, I've taken a general. Okay. Prabha, 
This is rather our drone rockery, which needs a bit of cleaning up. That one and that one are lavender. Suresh Mama and all would laugh and Tata shook the plants, but I think it's a great way to get the, get the, the dried leaves to fall. Do the things our parents did, though. We laugh at them when they did it. Isn't it? Yeah. And then one day you think, oh my god, I just become like my father. <laughs> Oh, my mother. <laughs> I've been associated with Kodikana from the time I've been young. I do remember my time as a child, my drives up to Kodikana, uh, listening to music in uh, the fancy car that my father owned, and how happy my mother was, who was always kind of uh, very short-tempered whenever she was back in Madras with so many things otherwise occupied. So, as Prabhupada said, it, it does have a calming effect, this place. So, the first big event was right after Pranati's wedding, which was our daughter Pranati's wedding, which was in May of uh, 2009. No, I would even say um, the Grahapravesam ah, of the house, house was done. Mm -hmm. We had my mm -hmm. son and my own children, that's my Aditya, my son, Pranti, my daughter, and Prabha's elder sister's uh, daughter, Smita, who came in to be as good as the daughter of the family. It, it was a landmark moment by the way it began. It's all yours, Prabha, now. Yeah. Okay, so after the housewarming, I remember coming up here just three days before Pranati's wedding, which was in May of uh, 2009. Because I was busy organizing a lot of things in Chennai. So I had to come here, get all the measurements for the curtains and furniture. Came up here, got everything set. Of course, she down, did a great job. I rushed, Fantastic. rushed down to Madurai to meet with the Samandis who were flying in from Athens. And then all of us, our entire family, my sisters, their children, brother, um, and Marco's parents, his brother, and his, the wife, the sister Marina, and her boyfriend, they all came. And I think all of us managed to fit into this home. And, and it was almost like what it was, the home was intended to be, full of people, and laughter, and fun, and games. And, and our dog, uh, Kobe, also came. And, uh, Did he? Yeah. Kobe, yeah, yeah, Kobe was here. Okay. Yeah. Landmarks, per se, would be after the wedding was uh, my 60th uh, birthday that was done here. Yeah, we had a uh, nice gathering and chanting of Rudram 11 times, which they call as Rudra Ekathasi. So we had uh, our priest from Tirvaru, favorite from friends and priests from Tirvaru come and do. And we would like to make this our home. And the landmarks and the milestones are there for us to consider making it our home. <laughs>